Hi guys, this is Fifth Channel True Reviews with Jane Smith. And today we are going to take a look at Audiobooks Comp. In this short video, we'll uncover all the cards, find out the truth about the size operation, and check if it's a legitimate business and why it's so popular. If you want to find out if Audiobooks Comp is a great option if you are looking for an audiobook subscription service or a scam for money, then watch this video to the end so you don't miss out on a lot of interesting information. Also, don't don't forget to subscribe to our channel and leave your comments below the video if you have had any experience with this site. Let's start! Audiobooks.com is a great option if you're looking for an audiobook subscription service. It has a great library and an attractive offer to sign up. Audiobooks.com has improved tremendously over the past few years. Although it started as a clone of Audible, this service has found its development lately, delving into podcasts and upping the end with free book subscriptions. You currently get three free books and a 30-day free trial for audiobooks.com, although that's not as good as it sounds. Still a great incentive to try this service. This is one of the main reasons with audiobooks.com ranks high on our list of the best audiobook services. One of the advantages of audiobooks.com over Audible is that you can purchase additional credits for the same price as the former. This makes it more flexible and cheaper if you listen to more than one or two audiobooks a month. Also, you can keep the books you purchased after cancelling your membership, unlike Netflix like Scribd, which runs as a streaming service and is another good option if you listen to a lot of books each month. It also means that on average the prices at audiobooks.com are competitive. We have found that customer reviews of audiobooks.com are mostly positive, even though there is a decent portion of customers who have reported negative experiences. For example, a user on Trustpilot.com under the nickname Queen Lee writes, Audiobooks.com is terrible. I can't speak to the quality of the audiobooks because I haven't listened to them, but I cannot unsubscribe. I got a subscription and immediately regretted it, so I tried to cancel it on my phone. No, you have to cancel it on your computer. So now I'm sitting on my computer and their website is so garbage that it doesn't even load the screen where I need to cancel it. Don't sign up for this. They will steal your money and have no regrets. Don't buy things without thinking about it, kids. Let this be a lesson to you as it is to me. And here Andrew left a positive review. There are many books to choose from, including from more specialized academic fields. It's a pleasure to listen to as you can stop and continue reading from another device at any time. The recommendations are also informative and based on your interests. The only inconvenience that prevents you from selectively accessing a particular chapter or section is that books are usually divided into untitled tracks with no clear correspondence to the book summary content. Prices and monthly subscriptions are affordable. If you have used the Audible audiobook app, you'll notice that Audiobooks.com has a similar design in its app, which is free to download from the Android and iOS stores. All the usual features you'd expect from the audiobook app are present. These include a sleep timer, narrative speed control, places for important notes, and bookmarks. All you have to do to get started is click a button, and a small window or a new window or tab opens, and then you can start listening. The organization of all these functions is also simple and user-friendly. For example, adjusting the volume is very easy, which is a plus for them. In addition, all the icons are contained on the main page rather than in the side menu. If you want to switch from the mobile app to your computer, you don't have to worry about losing your reading history. It also allows you to access your library on the web page, because it it provides syncing services on all the devices you use. When you visit the web page, you'll also notice that the last book you're listening to is there, along with added suggestions and other books you may not have finished reading yet. The site additionally gives you recommendations based on what you like, and there are reliable customer reviews on all the product pages. However, there are no chapter markers, so it's hard to tell how much time you have left to finish a chapter or how long it takes to get to the next chapter. This feature can be especially useful if you're listening to a short story or essay book, for example. The quality 
quality of the audio itself is also good, and there are no significant differences from audiobooks on the other platforms. One thing is for sure, this site's library is huge. With over 100,000 books to choose from, it gives you almost the same features as Playster, another good audiobook site. It's important to keep something in mind, although you won't always find everything you're looking for on audiobooks.com. It has a high level of leads, but they are about 75%. That's not a bad rate considering there are stores with fewer books and smaller libraries. But you won't always get the book you are looking for, even if it's popular. The library has nice features and a nice user interface, much better than some other sites. However, the bookstore should be able to provide you with the books you are looking for, at least when you sign up for a membership, even if it exceeds the usual cost. In this regard, some stores will outperform this platform, although it is still a good option. However, the site does have an advantage of a better known site such as Audible. It allows you to buy additional credits at the same price as when you first buy them. Thus, it is more affordable and has more flexibility, especially if you actively consume books each month. Also, once you buy a book, it stays with you even if you later cancel your membership, unlike Playster, which operates as a streaming platform. It's also good if you listen to a lot of audiobooks each month and need to work within your budget. Audiobooks.com only has one membership plan and while it doesn't hurt to offer a few more options, it does make it easier to sign up. With the membership, you get a free book every month from the VIP list on the site. The monthly fee is $14.95. The site offers a free trial and gives you one free credit to buy your first book from the premium catalog of more than 150,000 books, as well as the option to download another pair for the VIP book section. The VIP section is a nice little bonus exclusive to audiobooks.com and is a list of favorite audiobooks that changes every month. If you're a member of the site, not only do you get an audiobook for free each month, but you can also choose a second book from the VIP section. Although the section here isn't the newest of the new ones, you'll always find a book you want to try, from any genre of fiction or popular science fiction. Another great feature of audiobooks.com is the free 30-day trial, which gives you one free credit that you you can use to buy your first audiobook. If you're thinking about trying out the site, it's a good idea since you can cancel your subscription at any time without any additional complications. You can also check out their library and see if the books they have are what you're looking for. The apps themselves are easy to use, but they can take up a significant amount of memory. Because of this, you have to be careful. Also, don't listen to the books if you don't have a Wi-Fi plan. The website advises you to allocate about 150 megabytes for book storage, although it does not specify how much space each book takes up. The app itself is sleek and easy to use. You can shop and browse through the app as well as browse the library of books you've already downloaded. It's free to download from the App Store for Apple users or the Google Play Store for Android users. You can also listen through a web browser, so you'll be protected no matter which device you choose to listen to. It syncs your books to all the computers, tablets and smartphones you use, so you don't have to find your place every time you open the app on a different device. The player has all the standard features. Adjust Adjustable narration speed, sleep timer, bookmarks, and node locations. And its organization is simple. All the icons are on the main page of the app, rather than hidden in the side menu. The site offers recommendations based on the titles you view, which can help you choose your next book. The product pages also have customer reviews, which are verified by audiobooks.com before being published. The cancellation process is very simple. Simply visit the audiobooks.com website and click My Account to cancel your current subscription package or audiobooks.com app, then log in and contact your customer service team and ask for their help with the cancellation process. But keep in mind that as soon as you click on the cancel option, the company will immediately send a confirmation and they will immediately cancel what you requested to cancel the customer service. You must use audiobooks.com desktop website to completely follow the steps to cancel your membership process. Audiobooks.com cancellation will not take place unless you remove the application from your device. You must visit the desktop website and then permanently cancel your audiobooks.com subscription from your account. If there is any disruption in between processes, your account may incur any additional charges. After canceling your audiobooks.com account, you would like to keep your audiobooks collection, just try saving that 
demo CDs, DVDs or even flash drives that can be used in this copying process. This also creates a win-win situation for both subscribers and listeners, as well as producers, because it can provide a big advantage for both groups. The support features certainly won't impress you as they are not as developed as on other platforms. Audiobooks.com can be contacted by phone if you do so during daytime hours, and email support is also available. However, there may be some improvements to the thank you page and the live chat option is also unavailable. If you encounter any problem related to your audiobooks.com process, you can contact the customer service staff at any time and about any problems you encounter when accessing. Simply log into your audiobooks.com account from your cell phone, laptop or desktop computer to cancel your online account, or simply call customer service by phone Monday through Friday. You are sure to be offered a solution right away, or they will provide some assistance regarding the problem you are experiencing. So guys, thank you for your attention. These are all for today. If you still have any questions, please ask them in our comment section below this video. Wish you a great day and hope to see you again with us. Bye!